A pro-President Trump rally this afternoon at the Minnesota State Capitol remained peaceful. While the DPS commissioner said there are no credible threats, state leaders say they've ramped up security around the Capitol ahead of Inauguration Day. And that's where Danny Spiewak joins us live tonight. Hi, Danny. Hey, Chris, there is still a pretty big security presence here at the state capitol in St. Paul. The armored vehicles from the National Guard and State Patrol are keeping a perimeter and blocking traffic to the state capitol. Uh, we saw DNR officers on scene as well. There was a huge law enforcement presence, probably a couple of hundred officers on the grounds uh, at, uh, at its height this afternoon. But as we just mentioned, a very small group of people came here to protest in support of President Trump holding some signs. Uh, there really uh, really were no incidents. State Patrol didn't make any arrests. And I would estimate probably fewer than 50 people. And they were here for, for maybe an hour, an hour and a half, and were gone by about 1.30. Uh, so we asked the organizers just why they were here. Uh, and, and they told us that uh, they, they've basically been the same group that has protested some of the COVID-19 restrictions for the past several months. Um, they are, are uh, challenging the election results, of course, at uh, unproven claims of voter fraud that the president has floated. Uh, but they told us that they're trying to distance themselves from the Capitol riot that we saw in D.C. last week. We're just here to, you know, show all you guys that, hey, nobody's violent. And sometimes it's only two of us or five of us and sometimes it's 100, but we're never violent. And as I mentioned, State Patrol tells us they didn't make any arrests today uh, and that that crowd, um, you know, less than 50, maybe 15 or 20 people. But we saw the law enforcement presence. They were pretty clear this week. That's just a precaution. Everybody saw what happened in D.C. last week. They didn't want anything like that, uh, you know, especially with some of that threats that they had seen in December. But they called that dated. That was very important. They didn't have any recent or credible threats to the Capitol in Minnesota here uh, recently, at least. And so they have this large presence uh, and we'll probably continue here for the near future. Back to you. Danny, I know that there's another protest planned tomorrow that's at least uh, being said that it'll be much bigger. We'll see. Thank you for your reporting. Appreciate it.